laugh? You ready? She's got a selfie stick on her Nobody's head. Nobody's. <laughs> All right. Go Nobody's ahead. feeling more excited at Family Equality Council to have Rosie O'Donnell here. How are you? I'm good. You? Good to see you. We have the dog sniffers out, and Donald Trump is not here tonight. But if you Thank could say Lord. something to him, what would I you say now? At this point? I wouldn't even. Good. We only want to. There's no reason. Yeah. Okay. Good. We're just waiting for Bob Mueller. That's right. Exactly. My man, Bob. Let How you doing, Bobby? <laughs> Hope everything's good in your life. Hope the family's well. America's counting on you, sir, and we love you. Tell me now, so there's gay youth out there. There are many. Many. We um, were them. What do you say to them? I say, um, hang on, it gets better. It does get better. And, you know, I'm lucky I grew up in New York, so right. it's a whole different gig. But also I'm, you know, older. I'm 56 years old, yeah. and it was difficult to come out back at a time when there were no role models on television right. or in the media at all. Right. But now younger people, I find, have such my, I'm dating someone who's 20 years younger than I saw than that. It's 20 exciting. something, 22 and a half. <laughs> Lesbian cougar. What do you, now I'm asking you. 100%. I've done that. I've done that. When you go out with somebody that much younger, what have you learned from her and what, have she, what has she learned from you? I learned a lot of new music, number one. <laughs> I learned that um, police officers do it better. That's what they said. And I guess it's the truth. They pack it. Some of them do. <laughs> you set it up. And tell uh, me, and, and what does she learn from you, do you think? Uh, she learns patience. She learns bodies make strange sounds when they get old. Like, <laughs> ow, my, it's my hip. I think it's out. No, it is interesting. I told her when she asked me out twice, I said, you're too young. What, go to a therapist. Figure out why you want to date old, heavy women. And uh, here she is a year later. Oh, come on, you're amazing. Stop it. All right, thanks. How's Smilf going? What is Smilf? Smilf, Smilf, single mother I'd like to frequent, yes. How is that going? Really good. We start shooting again in June. Good. Yeah, I love it. What else do you want to do now? You've done so much. I mean, the state of Broadway is what it is. Yeah, I, I'm doing, I'm working on a new stand-up spe special. How are you? Knock, knock, who's there? Autism. My little five-year-old has autism. Wow. And I think it's a fascinating journey, and um, I don't know. That's what I thought I would do. All right. One question for Prouder. What are you most proud of? My children, ding, ding, ding. Yeah. My son is a Marine Good. right now, training, wow. School of Infantry. The little boy raised by a lesbian pacifist mother. <laughs> I think you're doing great. Thank you so much for your support of family equality. Uh, what's the hottest show on Broadway? Oh, that, what yeah. three favorite shows? She's seen them all. Well, I'm involved with yeah, but okay. uh, Angels in America, oh, okay. Three Tall Women. Oh. Um, what else? <laughs> what other shambles are you... <laughs> The, band, shows are the band's visit. Okay. And uh, Latin History for Morons is closed, but it's still, you know, it's nominated for a Tony. Okay. And uh, w once on this island. But but, but just to, to name a few thousand. We are here with the amazingly talented Ariana DeBose, who is in the Donna Summer Musical. And not just in it, okay? She is a Tony-nominated of characters. I mean, you I play am. what? Disco Donna? I am. I am Disco Donna Summer. <laughs> it is fun and thrilling and absolutely terrifying and I'm I am a Tony nominee all of a sudden how it's did crazy. that happen because you're talented <laughs> you're in Hamilton I was in Hamilton I was also in a Bronx tale right. um, directed by Robert De Niro and Jerry Zachs Love. it's all I've been really lucky to be surrounded by some really amazing and talented individuals and I find myself with an embarrassment of riches at the moment tell me your favorite Donna Summer songs Oh my what, goodness! Top three. top three. I feel love because nothing beats that. Dum 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 dum. So good. <laughs> and just tell everybody who watches and listens and reads Prouder. What are you proud of? What are you most proud of in your life? You know, I'm proud that I'm fortunate enough to be able to live my most authentic life. I can claim myself. I can claim whatever label. I can love who I love and not feel ashamed about it. And I don't have to hide. And it's the most freeing and endearing thing that I have ever experienced. Well, not a thing. It's not a thing. It's a feeling. And I try to live my life every day, each moment, filled with that feeling. Thank you so much, and thanks for supporting Family Equality and Prouder. All right, good luck to you, really. Thank, Thank you. you. Awesome. She's great. Well, our honoree tonight, Katie Kirk. Hi. Amazing. Congratulations <laughs> on the GLAAD Award. You're Thank like, you. You're like, it's like gay is good for you now, I right? know. <laughs> like, I'm like the LGBTQ No, but it's, no, but you're doing more than that. Everything you do and the natural You know, stuff. I think it's so important to, to help people understand these issues because yeah. I think when people don't, are confused or don't understand things, they're fearful. And fear, I think, is what breeds hate. Yeah. And so um, I think that by helping people along and explaining things and by discovering it myself I think 
it was a non-threatening way to take them on this journey with me. Right. And, and that's a family. They're, yeah. yeah, and I've had so many people come and tell me how important this documentary has been, not only for understanding themselves, but helping people understand who they are yeah. and, and, and giving them the information they need so they can be supportive. What are you most proud of? Uh, tonight? Anything. I'm just proud that, that, that this has been deemed worthy of being yeah. honored and, awesome. and recognized uh, by people who really know their stuff. Thank you.